Hello and welcome to the Male Dancer. This is a new vlog that I'm going to be talking about all the male dancer problems that you might have. Some of the benefits and risks of being a male dancer, how to be a healthy dancer, and things you could do as a male dancer to better your skills. Each week I'm going to be posting a video mentioning my experience as a male dancer, ways that I've come up with to help dancers across the world. I will also leave in the descriptions of my videos links to helpful sites related to the topic of the week. Feel free to post in the comments of any video that you see what you feel should be the topic of next week. I also, this week, this is what I want to talk about this week. I want to talk about dance belts. Now, a lot of people think dance belts? Ew, that's gross. I don't want something going up my butt. I want thong. But listen, I think it's really necessary. And not just for ballet dancers, but for any dancer. I'm going to tell you why. Dancers, you're not only artists, you're also athletes. And as male athletes, you have something that you got to protect down there. If you're jumping around and doing your thing, you have to make sure that you're protected. If you come down from a jump and your junk's flopping around, it can be very painful. So men, before you start taking class, make sure you take the precautions. There are some very painful and disgusting things that can happen to you if you're not careful. Now, as many of you might know, there are two types of dance belts. One is called the string belt, and the other is called the fullback. Now, some of you are thinking, whoa, 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 this is too crazy, I can't do this. Now, let me talk to you for a minute. You can start off with a fullback dance belt, which has no type of uncomfortable feeling for your butt. It's perfectly fine. It'll feel like regular underwear, basically. And what that will do for you is it will allow you to get comfortable with the feeling of a dance belt. Then, once you're comfortable with that, you can move on to the next stage and you can try out the string dance belt. Now, this is a very important step for ballet dancers and modern dancers because when you go out on stage and you're in tight, you're going to need to make sure that your butt looks nice. And it will not look nice in a full back. It's going to look it just it really looks awful. I've seen it before, and it looks bad. Also, for anyone who hasn't tried on a dance belt before, you need to lift up your penis and testicles and make sure that they're pointed upwards. This creates the bulge effect that you see in the professionals, and it looks sharp, and it looks very manly to the audience. And it's a clear way to distinct you from the females in the group. That's all for this week. Be sure to follow me on Twitter with Male Dancer Problems with the link in the description and hit subscribe right at the top, right there, over there, over there. Click the annotation at the top right to see the next video once it's up. And I've been Joseph Heitman, and thanks for watching this week's installment of The Male Dancer.